Hello everyone, this is Aida Gholami from Agrimat Soft Research Company and in this video I'm going to show you how to count rows in Excel. So uh, this actually has two approaches um, in two ways. The first one is to use uh, the rows function. So you can see I have um, one column of months and the second column of uh, the precipitation values in that month. So I want to know um, how many rows uh, are there, okay? So I will go for equal mark first and then type rows. So don't make a mistake with this row function because this one will show you the number of um, the row so it will say it's the second row okay but the, if you use rows function then um, it will tell you the number of the range you selected okay so I will go for this range and it will say it's 14 rows as I can see here so I said there are two ways okay so i will go for the first approach and the second one is that i can just select the whole column uh, that i want to count the rows in it by going up the column and in this alphabetic uh, character here when the mouse um, sign appeared like this I will select it and it will just show me here it will say count is 14 okay so I have 14 um, rows here and it says 14 so there are two tips for this approach actually this will just show you the number of rows that you have values in them so it doesn't count all these blank um, rows and the other tip is that if I go here and select it you can see there's nothing here because Excel won't show anything if you have just one cell of value in a whole column okay so it doesn't say it's one it doesn't show it it's blank um, in Excel site okay so I guess that's it for today's video I hope you learned something new please don't forget to give this video a thumb up and subscribe to Agamotsoft channel I will see you in the next video and bye